Dooby dooby doo. Pick it all up. Uh, come on. Your inventory, Your inventory is, full. is full. You can't hold any more. Told you. <laughs> uh. What are you? You're a zombie. And you breathe poisonous things. Your inventory you is full no anymore. Oh, but those are good griefs. Goodness griefs. So that was this? Okay. Well, we're heading back. Welcome to Ancient Greek Shop Simulator 2023. Because it seems like that's all we've been doing. No loitering. No loitering. No, man, that's why I, I keep on sell all this junk to you. Don't sell that. The bow, I mean, everything else Thank we can you sell. For not loitering. Thank you for not loitering. You're very welcome for not mean letting me loiter. Get the Infinity Louis Vuitton bag. That would be a thing. Like one of those pouches with uh, with an infinite. Like, do you? I mean, you can't hold anymore. You got the age where where the European comics were pretty high in the nineties, so you probably remember a couple of them. Do you remember Dawa Dobbert? That dude had a knapsack that could hold anything, and it also... Oh man, there was this thing here. And uh, it would also give him exactly what he needed once he reached into it. Rings a bell, yeah. So he just he just carried around a knapsack, and whenever he needed something, he just reached in and it came out. We need that. Boos Boos also had an infin <laughs> infinite belly back. <laughs> yeah, and a turtle for a best friend. And a, uh, a gorilla. Which was the only animal... Oh no, that's not true. I was about to say which was the only animal that couldn't talk in that show, but... Uh, only Boos and um, Dolly could talk. And the name of the gorilla? Shampoo. It's that... That show was something. That was hilarious. So whoever came up with that show was a genius. It was fun to watch. That's an understatement. <laughs> oh man, the things that that guy did. It was so absurd. The entire show was so absurd. Yeah, that brings back fond memories. Was uh, every time when um, at midday when when on on um, our basic school, our elementary school, home for lunch, it was half an hour of just cartoons, including Boos Boos. <laughs> Teletubbies is made by a person on meth. <laughs> yeah, that that guy was... Or girl, I don't know. I don't know who uh, Protective Simple you have went no to. More room. <sighs> of course not. But now we do. That didn't make any sense. So is that better than what we're wearing right now? No, it isn't. Not at all. I want that. I want that so badly. And I also want that. Oh man, we need so much so so many levels. 
What does that do? Shrine of Experience? Could have used that before. Oh well. The good old days were shows were actually meant for kids. No, it's the difference is that shows nowadays are still made for kids, but they're being watched by adults. That's the only difference. Back then, cartoons were mainly watched by by kids, and um, I think that left a mark because those kids are today's adults. And uh, whenever that reboot of My Little Pony happened, what was it Friendship is Magic? That's where it all went haywire. <laughs> so now all cartoons are being watched by adults, and since they're adults and everything is, is being remade or rebooted, everybody is angry. That's not what my childhood was like, I know, because it's a reboot. Someone reimagined. Your lovely, uh, lovely world there, buddy. Kuifje, also known as Tintin. I, I um, saw a trailer of a new Tintin animated movie coming out soon. Or was it a game? Video, probably a video game. I forgot. Could also be a video game. Cringe. <laughs> I uh, I had a friend because I myself we um, we had a lot of those weekly comics like Robidus and uh, um, Shorts and Shimmy and I had a friend who was a fan of Suske and Visca and I I didn't really like them. So I never understood why he collected those. Because I grew up with all the other ones. Yeah, Robidus was, uh, was a hero. Nothing like those Marvel or DC comics. He, he was a reporter? No, he, he was a bellboy originally, but... Then he changed into some sort of detective. With his trusty friend Krabbenaut. <laughs> they know the origins. We always went to uh, VND, the warehouse, and then uh, took a peek at the Royal Origins album. <laughs> oh, those were the comics. There's, uh, they still kind of exist online, I think. And the jokes were actually pretty good. Come to think of it, they were pretty innocent, but yeah, I mean... Spicy drawings. Some old comic store, yeah, probably. There's one at the end of uh, Oude Gracht. Is it still there? Was it... Uh, I forgot its name. Was it black and white? No. It's uh, it's close to City Hall. There used to be one close to City Hall. I remember that, a comic store. There's still two there. Yeah, I'm not sure if the one I'm talking about still exists. I hope it does. Not that I'm visiting, but I... it's... I like those stores. They they sell board games and comic books. Most of them are basically are comic stores with uh, a D and D section. <laughs> but yeah, those stores they are still big in Belgium. They're everywhere in Belgium. But here, it's mostly because those uh, the comics that I was talking about, Robodus and and. Um, that is Belgian. They had Belgian comics in there. So, yeah, it's... I have a friend from Belgium and, and he works at one of those stores and uh, he's... 
I was really surprised that those things still existed. So when I visited him, I was really excited. He's like, why are you so excited? I'm like, these don't exist in the Netherlands anymore. Not that much. He's like, well, there's five right in this center already. <laughs> so of course we had to visit all of them. There's so many satires here, man. Asterix and Obelix, absolutely. Who doesn't know them? They're still making movies. And to be honest, that last one, um, the Roman something, it's an animated one, but it's really good. It's really good. I can recommend it, but not the live action ones. I don't know why they made those, but the animated one? Okay, there's so many enemies here. I don't know the English name, but the Dutch name is the Romeinse Lustel. That's a that's a good one. It was on Netflix. I'm not sure if it's still on Netflix. Live action one recently something that plays in Asia. What? They have a new live action one, and and it's situated in Asia. That doesn't make any sense. The Twelve Tasks. Yeah, that one is on that. that, that I think that's my favorite. Asterix cartoon. Simply because of nostalgia reasons. Because it's not a it's it's not a good one, but it's the only one that's not based on uh, I'm sorry, what are we fighting? Spiders? Uh, it's it's the only one that's not based on, on a cart uh, a comic book. So it's just a standalone cartoon. But I like that one because it's the tasks are just it's fun. It's fast paced. Uh, the middle section on that that um, lost island, uh, island of pleasure, is really fun. I think why I like it is it's probably because it's um, it's kind of loosely based on on mythology. Like the, the 12 tasks of Hercules. And I was also always fascinated by that. And in that time, I also played Battle of Olympus on the NES. Which is also, well, Greek. Based on Greek mythology. So everything in my head just clicked together. Uh, and also that, that Heisman... Heis, Heis uh, what's his name? Stop motion dude, that movie, uh, Jason and the Argonauts, came out. Yeah, everything was just. Oh, there's another cave there, my god. The taxes, that is still. That task is still going on today. This is, th th that's just bureaucracy at its finest. It's horrible. And the way they fixed it is so smart. Like, oh, you want, you want, you need form, four uh, A. No, I'm, I'm, I want form five B. No, that doesn't exist. And then everybody else gets crazy. <laughs> uh, it's time to sell some more stuff. Yeah, twelve A, no twelve B. That's the one. I did, I'd wear it, but okay, let me ask. <laughs> and everybody else go crazy. Oh, that's such, such a good solution. But just go to any city hall and, and that's that's what's going on. You're at the wrong uh, at the wrong spot. Nice. You need to go to the fifth floor. Sell that, sell that, sell that, sell that, sell that. Sell that. Those are better. These are also better. Plus five intelligence. Yeah, bro. And I use those too. I'm already at ninety-seven intelligence. You again. Yeah, you you again. Now I can sell those things. 
fix it. Oh wait, there was a buckler that I don't need. Thank you for not loitering. You're welcome, buddy. Uh, do I have any points? No. But I'm almost leveled up. Let's ask the prefix. And then, then there's this dude just swinging on a on a swing, being pushed by uh, some young lady. <laughs> I'm busy. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's a good movie. And also, what they don't really make very clear is the creature. Do you remember that in the, the cave? They have to go into the cave with all the weird ghosty things. And then they suddenly meet the creature, which is a big floating head. And then it just cuts to uh, Rome. What happened to the creature? I think... Obelix ate him. Yes, it was in the cave where he wants to sleep. That That's the one, because... Before that, he got woken up... On the field where uh, all the, the dead Roman soldiers are, and... Obelix is trying to hit them, but he can't because they're ghosts. So they don't sleep, and then they end up in the cave with the creature, which is a big floating head. But what happened to that creature? Second skill mastery. Okay, okay, okay. Which, which, yes. I know what I want to do for the second skill thing. Um... But I can only do one thing at the same time because my head is not working. Also, I hate these spiders. I hate them so much. So, I actually think that Obelix ate the creature. The beast or whatever it's called. Because he says something like it, it was a... Uh, it was some tough meat or whatever. But they they never really let you know what, what happened. He, he also ate the whole kitchen, yeah. <laughs> uh, one camel. Two cows. <laughs> six sheep. <laughs> oh, there was so much. He ate it all, I'm bankrupt. Yep. But hey, that was the challenge. The, the, I mean, the guy was hungry. And he still asked for more afterwards. Like, he was like, hey, these are the appetizers. Where, when is the main course coming? <laughs> uh. The weird one was the towel test. Why was that weird? Because... One was washed with Olympus, and the other one wasn't. <laughs> so which one was softer? I mean, it doesn't always have to make sense. It was like watching a commercial, but I think that was the joke. <laughs> because back in the days, those the commercials were exactly like that. Exactly like that. Where, where they just pretended to be um, walking on the street with with two uh, piles of towels and then ask people, hey, which one is softer? Yeah, this one. Oh, well, that's washed with product X. Yeah, I like that movie. I like it a lot. It's a good movie. And, and, and also on Pleasure Island, where they, they're just dancing and everything, and basically Asterix is falling in love, and then Obelix goes, Well, I'm hungry. Well, we don't have any food. What, do you expect us to cook for you? <laughs> and he's like, Well, I'm off. <laughs> uh, there's nothing for me here. Twenty dancing around him. All he wants is food. He's like me.
All the gods on the clouds. Yeah, well, we got honey and nuts. Yeah, <laughs> honey and nuts. No, I want boars. <laughs> so. Honey and nuts. That's not gonna work. Yeah, come to think of it, that cartoon had had no goal. <laughs> it had no goal whatsoever at the end. They were just considered gods by by Caesar and um, that's it. The entire movie made no sense. But it was fun and it's it's uh, quite a short one. I think it's only an hour long. Village of Tegia. Do we have another portal here? Uh, no, but we have I a trader. I sell plows and scythes to farmers, but since the monsters, it's been swords and shields, leaves and spears. Well, I'm gonna sell everything there. Anyway. What are you doing? Okay, you, you got everything under control, right? Do what? It's I want. Where's the portal? There's this that I need. Rebirth fountain. Excuse me. Where's the portal? I'm gonna talk to you later, young Tegan. What the heck? Did I? That's going out of the village. Where? Is there not a portal? I don't think there might be a portal. Oh. Oh. Um. Unless I'm blind. The water right. by our village has gone foul. It happened just the day before last, after the first satyr was spotted. My sister got sick, and then my neighbor. Poison Spring. It's a side quest. But where do we go to? There's three ways out of the village. What way do you want me to go? Also, I don't like spiders. Can I level up, please? Explore. <laughs> okay, then. Let's follow this path. I don't think there's a portal in that village. To Gia Spring. Is is this poisoned or something? No idea, I'm, I'm so confused. I'm a little bit overwhelmed now. Copper suit is. Yo, that's a green sword. What does that do? It's a shitty one. You need player level 15. And it only does 11 to 14 damage. The heck is that about? These do a lot more damage though, those Sudises. Sudai. What's the plural of a Sudis? What are you? Mortal, I am Anayad, the spirit of this spring. Pagia, I am called. My water has been tainted and I am ill. Vile spiders have come to dwell in a cave by my water's source. They are the cause of the poison. Oh, okay. Well, let's go in. Also, let's get a little friend out. Fetid layer.
Yeah, you are really strong. I I like that. You are exceptionally strong. So what is poisoning? This water, is it the spiders? Do we just need to eliminate all the spiders? We leveled up again, by the way. So I need to... Should I put it in dexterity or intelligence first? I think dex... I'm not sure. The one that is... Uh, that's opening up the item faster. Could be intelligent. But I'm not sure. So many th things going on here. I'm not even going to pick up those white items anymore. Because they suck anyway. I mean, it's easy money, but come on. So many items. And I'm pretty sure that it will stay there for a while, so if I ever get room again, I can always pick it up. Man, you just one hit them? You have no more Your inventory room. is full. Your inventory is full. So you need level nine, so I can a lot of intelligence. And you need 96, so both will not happen. But I'm gonna put some stuff in dexterity. Because now we're a little bit closer to using that bow. And the bow actually seems really good because it does a lot of damage. So, if I could level up again, that would be neat. Which means we gotta kill more Earth's gold. More creatures. And do more quests. What's going on here? What are you? This side's extremely scary. Also, I need to activate that. Oh my god. Static Axe of Destruction. Copus of Destruction. Okay, we're heading back. We need to sell some stuff. Back to Sparta we go. Dun dun dun. You follow me? Okay. What is it this time? Uh, no, no, no. Plus four dexterity, yes. No. That's a lot of money. But I'm not going to use it. Uh, okay, let's equip that ring. On... That one. So now we have 89 decks, which is still not enough, but more than we had before. We are still in the Sparta section. Wow. Alright, what is all this then? What did we find? Weapons. Okay, so... Stuff we can sell. I'm being poisoned. Save me. Tough Arachno's arm plates of energy. What? Strength 80. Dang it. I'm not. But it's plus energy. Which is good for... Oh my god. So do we really have to do... 
like an average build, so we also have to put some points in strength now. Holy crap! You dropped so many good items. You have no more Your room. Room. You have no more room. What did we pick up? Holy moly. Alright. I am... This is... What the heck is going on? All these items, they dropped out of two spiders. Do I... I should probably have a storage chest somewhere, don't I? No, I don't know. Anything. Anyways, I... I'm gonna sell these. Ah, uh, man. They're all good. Well... Those aren't. Well, they're good, but that's for me. But these two? I cannot decide. Because this one gives me more health, and that one gives me more energy. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna keep them both for now. Decisions, decisions. I really do not know. I can't make up my mind. Your inventory is full. What did I pick up now? Fuck me. There's so but that one is better, so I can sell them. Uh Yes. Okay, protect me. Our Sparta's incoming. Jesus, why are you not protecting me? I am very sorry. More stuff? What is going on here? I know I asked for better stuff, but holy, that is, are they part of a set? Is that a thing? I should, I should check that. It's not part of a set. No loitering. You want those? You want that too? You want that? You can have it. I need to find a way to combine these, can I? Oh, combine items, there. That one with that one. That one with that one. That one with that one. Okay, and what do they do? Plus 4% attack speed. Yeah, but I kind of want them to be full. Okay, but we can combine them. That's good. Right, let's pick up all this other stuff. So many things. Look at all that. You have no you more can't room. carry anymore. Can't carry anymore. It's because I picked up everything again. This helmet though. Poof. Plus three dexterity, I'm gonna save for that, so I need to put some strength in. Then I can also wear them. Alright. 
Oh, uh, now I need to make decisions. Do I go for strength or do I go for dexterity first? Alright, so that worked. You have no more room. I have no more room. What are you doing? Are you attacking that spider web? Why would you do that? There's more stuff. Oh my god, all these spiders. So much stuff. And we're not going to use it. You have no more room. It's another cheating thing. That's another uh, armor. Your inventory is full. Anymore. It's fine. Your inventory is full. I know. Or in a chest. Your inventory you is full. You can't room. carry anymore. I am going to drop this. And that. And I'm going to pick up anymore. those things. What is that? That's a sh... It's... Oh, it sucks. It all sucks. There's more spiders. We can use the experience points. Alright, that's this cave. My goodness. Is there a shrine here? There is. More enemy. This cave just doesn't end. It simply doesn't end. And I, I'm carrying way too many things already. I'm not even gonna pick that up. What's in this bone pile? You have, you have no, no more room. room. Your inventory you is have no more room. No more room. You no more I want that full. arcane formula, please. You can't carry any more. Are you kidding me? Drop that. Now I can. Wraith Guard. Can I combine these? I cannot combine those, but... Oh. I, I see. Because... I see. <laughs> yeah. I, I need stuff for that. So I probably need to go and uh, You have cleansed the poison from the cave. I have Our waters will run clear and clean again. You're welcome. Alright. So we got some more XP. Does that also solve this side quest? Or was that uh part of the same thing? Probably was part of the same thing. So yes, it does complete this side quest. That one. Um, this one. Thanks to you, the spring is clean and good for drinking. All in the village will be grateful. Oh, you're welcome. I... I sing now muse of the goddess huntress we call Artemis. And I sing of a mortal man named Actaeon. The goddess Artemis, sister to Apollo and mistress of the moon. There is no greater hunter than she, none more fleet or sure of her mark with bow or spear. Actaeon too was a master hunter, and many a deer fell to his bow, and many offered up to Artemis in thanks. But Actaeon was given an ill fate. One night, chasing a boar, he burst into a clearing by a stream, and there, 
that very stream had keen-eyed Optimus selected for her moonlit bath. Naiads, dryads, all her nymphs around her. She had just disrobed and stepped into the stream when Actaeon appeared, wild from the chase. She grew angry that a mortal man had seen her unclothed, and with one cold look, she turned him to a stag. A stag he then became, and Actaeon's own dogs chased after him, snarling at their master. Now they're prey. Well, there's some lore. Those shields are quite sturdy. Okay, sell some stuff. Uh, yeah, no. Artemis guide you. That's a di I saw them. I noticed some graves. And when there's graves, there's skeletons. I got a stalker, yeah, I got a buddy. He's helping me out. Okay, you dropped so many items again that are... Kind of useless, especially since my inventory is getting a little bit cramped. <sighs> I found another piece. I found oh, level ten, level nine. See? Necromancer's robe, Necromancer's leggings. Yes, 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 yes. We are going to use that, but I need... I need to level up. And that's gonna take a while. Because we're only halfway, not even halfway through this current level. Before we uh, get to level 9. Oh boy. Leveling up is taking very long. But we will get there eventually. Gotta be patient, right? Alright, what's what's up here then? Zombie? Where are the zombies? Oh, they're down there. Right, those are the satyrs. What is... What am I even doing here? I still need to find my way to Megara. I don't even know why I'm in this area. Huh. Will there be more side quests? Because... I kind of can't use the experience. Did we level up? We got a plus. I see a plus. Does that mean... No, not there. Here? Oh, of course, we can do that one. So we already did uh, Spirit, but I my second one will be Hunting. And uh, I am... I do have three skill points, so I'm gonna put them there. And this one will be once I'm done with, yeah, my spirit thing. Or whatever. I don't know. So many decisions that I have to make. And I'm not good at that stuff. I'm not good at min-maxing everything. A harpy witch. Am I going the right way? Pristine plumage. There's stuff down there. Uh, 
I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Well, that's another camp. This, this does something. Do you have good items for me, my fellow warriors? I hope you do. At least you got gold. No, you can keep that. Been there. So there is a way. There is a way going this way. What the heck is going on here? Uh, can you not choose a target? It's so much easier with a little friend helping you out. Especially when he's as strong as that dude. Oh god, this is... Uh, one of these ruins again. Might not be bad, though. Just a chest. Your inventory is full. I know. I know it's full. It's fine. I'm not picking up stuff. Because the stuff sucks anyway. <laughs> NPC 1. He's going the wrong way. Should we hint him? NPC 2. Nah, he's just side questing. They all find their way eventually. <laughs> I mean, the game is pretty linear. You can't go wrong. But this area seems... Uh, there's a lot of things to explore. It usually just opens up into two or three paths. Okay, well, here we go. Ancient tomb. Lots of, lots of those sepulchers again. Will we finally find something interesting here? I mean, we already found a lot of stuff that we want to wear and use, but our level isn't high enough. So we do need to level up. Yeah, let's kill everything. And then open up whatever's in those tombs. And crusts. Alright. What's here? <laughs> Treasure. Your inventory is full. Your inventory is full. Excuse me, that's blue. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. I'm sorry, I, I see it. You have no more room. Fuck you. The blue thing. Is it good? It is good, but it's not for me. Oh, that sucks. Your inventory you have is no room. It's fine, though. We can sell it for lots of money. All right, that was a very good piece of armor, but I'm not using it because I'm not going for strength. Those traps, though. I think you're smart, eh? Where way should we go? This way? Let's go this way. Too many skeletons. And they're not even skeletons or zombies. Too many treasures. 
Why, why do you have a blue thing? What does that mean? Are they being protected by something? Oh no, they killed my lich. There, I have a new one. I'm almost dying. Zombie hero? Okay, I'm gonna get rid of these zombies first, and then uh, we're gonna take care of that zombie hero. I hope you drop something worthwhile. Probably not, but... Man, do you respawn zombies? Is that it? does. Oh, but we we killed a hero monster. Uh, and by we, I mean not me. You can't, you can't, carry, carry, you can't anymore. carry anymore. P Pupil's Wraith Clasp of Endurance. Axe of Reckless Power. What is all this? Intelligence 100. <gasps> We're almost there. But then we can use it instead of those things then, I guess. I mean, maybe not. Yes, I want that. Oh, so many things. Also, this X of Reckless Power that I probably want to sell. But the thing is, I don't want to sell these. Well, probably that one, Mars Garment. Uh oh. I don't know what to do. Well, I know what to do. I want to level up. Your you can't carry anymore. And then I can use the, the stuff that I'm carrying, and then I can sell the stuff that I'm wearing. And, and that will open up no more room. room. But I need to level up. Ta, <laughs> miss me. Missed me with that trap shit. It would be so great if we can level up here. Because I hope that that would actually... Would that already free up? Do we have enough points to free up some space? Because I get one point and I should... I should probably spend that in dexterity so we get that new bow. Uh, but I could also... <sighs> I could also put it in intelligence. But then I am sure, because if I put it in intelligence, I'm pretty sure that I can eventually wear a lot of armor that I'm carrying. But we're not there yet. At all. So that's going to be a thing. But I think we also just eliminated this area. What does the map say? Yeah, we cleared most of that, so the only only way is north. The only way left is north. Which is actually not true because the only way left is uh, is west, but the only way up is north. See what I did there? Did a joke. <laughs> I 
Right. What I'm going to do is kill the boar. What I'm going to do is kill the sand tower. Have I not killed anything here? I can't sell stuff because I... Everything that I'm carrying I want to use. All oh, right, we, we... Okay. We got here. Let's see if we can get to a spot where there's a portal. Or at least another village thing. Diseased plumage. You can't hold any more. Are you shitting me? I should be able to combine them. That's pristine. That's different. Crap. It's different. What are those? Drop that. Uh, these I can combine. There, so now it's three out of five. That's a shrine. Another disease plumage. <gasps> Level up. We leveled up. Okay. Okay. Okay, hang on. Hold on. Another disease plumage. Okay, hang on. Hold on. First of all, we're gonna do that. Um, there. Pick that up. And also add the, this one. So now that's full. Now we got one disease plumage. Do we need that for... No, we don't. So what does it do? It can enhance all armor, but I, I don't want to use that on this armor yet. You can't hold any more. Stuff. All right. Okay. We leveled up. We leveled up. We need to kill... Never mind. We need to... This one needs level 10 and a lot of intelligence. This one needs 96 dexterity. That one needs a lot of strength. That one needs 100 intelligence. That one needs 80 strength. And that one needs 116 intelligence. Okay, what I'm going to do is put one index. Ah, shit. I'm going to put two index. So now we have a better weapon. And now we need to save up for the intelligence. And strength. Because I do want that armor. <sighs> right. Too many things going on. Too many things that we need to do. Um, but I am going to leave it here for today. We've been streaming for quite some time already. So I want to thank everybody for watching. If you're watching this on YouTube, please consider subscribing. It's free. And don't forget to leave a like and a comment. If you're watching this on Twitch right now, thank you very much for joining me. And please consider following. It would really help me out. Anyways, thank you for watching. And I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.